All right, y'all. Happy Wednesday. Um, it is about 11 o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, I just went to Costco and I spent $150. I hope you guys can see me because I know there's a glare from the sun. But y'all, I just lugged all this stuff up here by myself. Look, I laid it all out on the floor. <sighs> I'm out of breath. I did this alone. But if you guys can see me, which I hope you can. Okay, I spent $150, y'all. $150. Um, y'all, they were having some good deals at Costco. I could not pass them up. So, uh, yeah, that's why I spent that much. But, we're about to do this, y'all. We're going to do this haul outside. I know it's, it's, it's a little ratchet to do that, maybe. But, <laughs> bear with me. Because, as you can tell, I didn't lug all this by myself. The water man came, y'all, as I was pulling up. So, he brought the water up here. But, let's get into this. Okay. So, here goes the Costco haul outside, y'all. Like I said, this might be a little ratchet or whatever, but just deal with it okay just bear with me because i did this by myself i brought all this by myself all right so pizza i grabbed one pizza you guys know the kiddos love pizza uh, so i went ahead and got one um thing of water um even though i get those waters for my water dispenser um this one right here is good like for grab and go um especially like when my son is um training for soccer so that's awesome the propel y'all the propel was like on sale um this is ten dollars usually it's a little bit more but it was ten dollars so ten for twenty four that's awesome um i got the apple juice there's two my kids love the apple juice um so yeah um better substitute apple it's a better substitute than drinking soda you know so Apple juice usually is at dinner time for the kiddos. Um, one gallon of uh, 2% milk. Ooh, what was that over there? Um, so yeah, one gallon of 2% milk. Um, squatting, y'all. Um, okay, the grapes. I got grapes. Um, I actually got two strawberries, y'all, because the strawberries look so good. So here's one right here. You see one right here? The tilapia loins, these things are freaking yummy. I love them, they're thick. Um, so yeah. I usually get the chicken nuggets, but I wanted to get the chicken tenders, or the chicken strips instead this time, so I just went ahead and got those. Y'all, this is, hang on y'all. Let me sit on my butt. Okay. I'm literally sitting on my butt. So these right here, y'all. Um, I haven't seen them before. This is my first time seeing them, but they ha had them um, buy one, get one free. So I went ahead and got them to try them. Buffalo chicken rolls. Um, it says dark meat with cheese. I mean with chicken cheese, celery, onion, and spicy buffalo sauce. So I thought that might be a great thing to try out. I think my husband might like it actually. So I got two of those. This is something new, y'all. Japachi, Japache, I don't know. Glass noodles with vegetable. Um, it's Korean traditional noodles. Uh, they look so yummy. I think I was just really hungry, but they looked really yummy, y'all. So I can't wait to give these a try. There's only six in here. I believe this was eight dollars. So hopefully it's really good. Got that, baby. Um, you guys see the chips over there? I got the 54 count of chips, the big bag of tortilla chips, cause we go through that a lot in my house. Um, the big thing of six count of romaine, uh, romaine lettuce. That's for our, our salads, some blackberries, the mini tacos y'all. This is like an awesome snack, like after school snack. Really like that. So here's the other thing of strawberries. See, look, y'all, they look really, really yummy. Um, of course, bananas. That's like a staple in my house. 
Um, in here is a rotisserie chicken. So yeah, figured that'd be something to munch on. And then I grabbed the grilled chicken breast strips um, for our salads. So I figured this would be awesome for the salads. Um, I'm gonna put one in the freezer. So I'll put this one in the freezer and put this one in the refrigerator. So yeah. And that is it y'all. So let me get my butt up off this floor. Okay guys, so my fat butt is off the floor. Now, all I got to do is just lug all this stuff from the porch, bring it in the house, and put it up, and then I have to run to the commissary um, to get more meat, um, more produce. Uh, that's it, I think. So just more meat and more produce. Uh, yeah. All right, guys, so that is my Costco haul. I spent $150. Um, that's Kobe back there. Can you see him? There he is. Where is it? Dang it. I couldn't. Oh, okay. Boop. There he is. All right, guys, I'm, and look, I'm looking a hot mess, but you know what? For some reason, like, okay, so I've been sick with the flu for literally, like, today makes it like a whole, um... So I got sick last Wednesday, today is Wednesday, so what is that, like a whole week or something? I don't know. But, y'all, I'm telling you, this flu going around is not good, okay? It is not good. So, um, but I'm feeling better. Just every time I wake up, I always have like a sore throat, so I don't know. But I'm feeling better. Alright guys, so let me end this and um, I'll get back to you guys with the commissary haul. Okie dokie, y'all. So I'm back in the house. Um, I ran to two stores now. Um, right here, what you see is the commissary. Um, and then, whoop, over there is from Lidl. Guys, and I know I might be pronouncing this wrong, but I'm going to say Lidl. Um, Sundari was getting on me because I was, last time I was saying like Lidl, um, Little, Lidl, I don't know, Lidl. Listen, whenever I have time, I will look it up and try to figure out the right way to say it. But I stopped over there and at the commissary. So the commissary, I spent uh, $175, y'all. Uh, yeah, $175. Doesn't look like a lot, but yeah. Um, all right, so let's jump into it. And remember that all of this that you guys are seeing, like you guys just saw the Costco, all of this is for a family of five, okay? Family of five. Okay, soup. I just bought one. Um, this is a six pack of the cup of soup shrimp. I bought two of these roasted garlic mashed potatoes. Listen, if y'all talk about people who buy these quick potatoes, y'all don't know how busy mommies are. Um, yeah, stay-at-home moms are busy, y'all. So, yeah, this is quick and easy. I don't have to cut potatoes and boil them and do all that. So, there. Um, why I explained, I don't know. But, um, multi-pack, the Chex Mix, the cheddar, I bought that. Um, I bought these McCormick, uh, Montreal. Yeah, I bought three of them. Um, I bought three of these because I bought some steak. Um, but my husband loves this seasoning. Some spaghetti. I didn't realize this said habanero hot when I got it, but it's okay. We love hot stuff. Um, the Quaker chocolate chip bars, um, some chili mix, um, two of these ranch seasoning. Uh, my husband's making like a buffalo chicken dip and he uses that. Um, I haven't bought these in a while so I thought I might spoil the kids with these little cookies. Some sugar for my coffee, some croutons and some bacon for salad, um, some eggs. I got two of the 18 pack of eggs um, and this is the Eglin Best and then I got one 12, um, one carton of 12. Go Go Squeeze for the baby girl. Um, Jello. Kylie loves the Jello. Um, the Minnie Mouse waffles are, of course, for Gianna. The cinnamon, cinnamon, what is this? Toaster sticks and the waffles are for the big kids. Um, cinnamon Toast Crunch. Um, I bought two different cheeses, one triple cheddar and one pound 
of sharp cheddar. I think my husband's going to use that one. Um, I saw this and I was having like a little sweet tooth and I really don't, I don't eat sweets a lot. Um, but you guys saw those strawberries I got from Costco. So I said, hey, get this and put those strawberries on top. Yum. Uh, some chicken patties. Kylie loves these um, and I don't buy them a lot, but you know what? I was like, I'm just going to make it easy on myself. So yeah, bought chicken patties. They are really good too. Mandarin oranges, I got two of them. You guys know the little one loves these. Um, some sour cream, the Philadelphia, the cream cheese is for my husband's uh, buffalo chicken dip. Um, some butter. Of course, deli sliced turkey for my son, Mark. Velveeta cheese, um, you guys know, for your sandwich. Um, two things of bacon. Some uh, hot dogs, um, some toothpaste. First time buying this, um, the Suavitel, um, but I, I've, I've heard pretty good things about it. A lot of people buy it, and they do sell at the Dollar Tree. Um, I think it's a smaller one, but um, it's okay. I bought the bigger one because um, I do a ton of laundry in my house, and I opened it up, and it smelled really good, so I'm going to give it a try. Of course, for the dishwasher, um, some Axe body spray, some deodorant, a, pa a family pack of steaks. What are these? Um, New York strip steaks. It was seventeen twenty nine. There's four of them in there. Um, a family pack of ground beef. This was nine twenty six. Some tater tots. Um, veggie blend. Um, one pack of juice because I still have, my bin is still filled up with juices. So that's why I only got one. A pack of ribs. Um, some green onions. Some cilantro. Habanero peppers. Look at this. Huge pepper, y'all. They didn't, like their small jalapenos were not looking good. So I got this big old huge one, y'all. Yeah. Some shredded lettuce. Um... Of course, the Arm & Hammer for sensitive skin, uh, some ranch for the salad, some mayo, home style, the thick and hearty meat, first time buying it. Um, of course, our favorite soy sauce, some um, ketchup, one can of beans because I'm going to make chili, but I already have another can already. Some orange juice, Dino Duck, um, the strawberry banana, this, I love this, um, it's really yummy, so I'll drink this like in the morning. Um, so yeah, all of that, just all of that right there. It's not a lot. That is all from commissary. All right, so let's get into Lidl. Or is it Lidl? I don't know, y'all. Okay, so, um, and over there, y'all, they do have name brands, but they have a lot of off brands, and off brands are okay, y'all. I mean, it saves money, and if it still tastes good, then go for it. Um, so I bought the Pop Tarts. They were on sale. They were like two fifty or two sixty. So good price for the big one. I bought this all man body wash for my son. Y'all, these were like um, they were less than a dollar. I think like seventy nine cents or sixty nine cents a piece. They smell good. So, and I bought the different one. This one says Hustle. This one says Sport. So um, I'm gonna let him test them out and if he likes them then I'll look for it again creamy peanut butter this was like a dollar awesome um, the pancake mix I bought this before um, tastes really good it's cheap too it's like a dollar and something so the fruit snacks my kids love them and they're not hard you know how cheap fruit snacks are hard these were not hard so they loved them went back and got them I got a mini watermelon the Italian bread, you guys, this was like a dollar and like nine cent or something. Um, you guys know my son loves his sandwiches on like sub bread. It looks like, so it's like Subway kind of. So I love this one from them because it's really soft. Um, so and then I got, two, I got one of these um, salsa, the, the cheese salsa. Um, I got two of these um, mini beef raviolis. Let Kylie and Gianna try those out. Of course, I got my wine. 
Moscato. And it tastes really good, y'all. It's actually a little strong, but hey. Put you to sleep. Um, there are paper towels. There's two in here. And they're um, hot dog buns and they're hamburger um, dumbs. Hamburger buns were super cheap. I think these were like 65 cents. This one was like 55 cents. So yeah, super cheap, y'all. I spent exactly $30 here at Lidl. Um, so I don't know, y'all. I think it was pretty good. Um, and then the bags. Here are the bags, y'all. Of course, their bags are 10 cent a piece, which it's not bad. I mean, it's a deal. All right, guys. So there is all my hauls. Um, as you guys can tell, I didn't buy a lot of meat. And that's because we have a lot going on. Um, a lot going on. Pretty busy. And um, that's why. And then I have simple things like you know, these to throw in the oven. I got the chicken strips. I got the stuff from Costco. So, yeah, that's why I didn't buy a lot of meat because we're just busy, busy, busy on the go. And um, Super Bowl is coming up. I'm not going to cook probably this weekend. My husband's probably, he, he said he wants to buy um, seafood. So, of course, I won't cook this weekend. And, yeah, so that's why. All right, guys, this is my haul for about two weeks um you can add it all up um so i hope you guys have a blessed day um and i'll talk to y'all later all right guys bye